Hi everybody, welcome to Breakfast at Tiffany's. It is Friday, January 13th. It's Friday the 13th. Does that scare anybody? That doesn't scare me anybody, anyway. But you know what it made me remember? La um, when my son was in, uh, I don't know, it must have been like before high school, maybe middle school or something. We started a new um, uh, tradition in our house where um, my son loves pie, but he didn't get pie very often. So we made it a tradition that on Friday the 13th we would get a pie or get some pies or you know, have pie. And um, it kind of came from the pie day from March 13th, but you know, we made it every Friday the 13th we would have pie. So we made it a good thing. But we haven't done that in many years, and I just recall that it's Friday the 13th, and I should probably get him pie, because now that he's moved back in, he's, he's here, and we should, I should get him a pie and see if he remembers pie day, <laughs> our pie day on Friday the 13th. But it doesn't scare me. Does it scare you? I mean, I feel like um, it's just, just a day. It's just a day. Just a day for pie. That's what you should do. Like, I love taking something with a negative connotation and turning it around and making something positive out of it, like pie. Um, now, let's get to important matters. Like, am I the only person in the world who still has their Christmas decorations up? Just let me know. <laughs> I mean, yes, this tree is still decorated for Christmas, although I do have a Valentine's Day sign right there. So, um, I'm getting, slowly working on, it's kind of like a hybrid going on around here, but I will be changing Mrs. Goose's outfit and the tree this weekend. I'm going to take a video when I do it because it is time to change things. My mom is coming today. She's going to say, oh, hi, Oreo. My mom is coming today. She's going to stay for the weekend and she's going to help me de-decorate, undeck the halls. It's my least favorite thing to do in the entire world. <laughs> well, maybe not the entire world. But I love decking the halls, and I don't like undecking the halls. I mean, it looks so beautiful. I don't want to take it down. I don't. And if you, and that's like the advantage of the fake tree. I've always done real trees, but last couple of years I've done fake trees. And that's the advantage of the fake tree. You can leave it up as long as you want. It's not going to, you know, droop and fall and leave needles all over the floor. And dry out to be like a fire hazard. But today and this weekend, I have to get motivated to undeck the halls. It's not fun. And it's also hard for me to always fit that into my schedule in January because in January, I'm super busy. I'm also a bookkeeper and the bookkeeper's life is really busy in January. There's a lot of stuff to do, and I've got my job bookkeeping to do, my personal bookkeeping to do, and my mother's bookkeeping to do. So I've got, and the store, you know, of course. So there's a lot. Um, January is very busy, but store-wise, Vicky and Lori and I have been super busy working to bring you some great Valentine's Day stuff. We have so much Valentine's Day decor. That we are just about to get ready to list. Vicki just took the pictures the other day. We're getting ready to list them. They will be available. Um, we're gonna, we can't show all of them because there's too many. We only, we do 50 items in a live sale and we probably have more than 50 items. I'm sure we have more than 50 items that we could show you for Valentine's Day. So we're gonna pick the best and we're gonna bring them to you on our live sale, which is a, just a week and a little over a week away, January 22nd. You want to be there, Facebook, 7 p.m. Don't miss it. It's really, really going to be fun. And we're going to have so much great stuff. So much great stuff. I can't even tell you how great the great stuff is. It's really great. <laughs> so join us, please. Save the date. Friday, January, I mean Sunday, January 22nd at 7 p.m. on Facebook. Anyway, we have been listing, listing, listing every day, listing so many items, and we are still not anywhere near done. 
There's so much more to come. A lot of red items too. Red, pinks, valentines. There's so much, so much, so much, so much. So it's going to be a great sale. And uh, some of that stuff, a lot of the red items are already available on our eBay store. So you can go check it out. But there's more added every day. We are adding stuff all the time. And yesterday I posted a post that was gave a gave us some of the Valentine's Day items that we have available. You can just, you can shop that post on Instagram or Facebook. So I did that. Um, what else do I want to tell you? Not sure. I think that's about it. I don't have a lot to say today. Um, but I am. So many exciting things are coming in 2023. I'm getting so excited. I don't think I've mentioned this yet, but we're going to be doing a porch party in March. And I'm really excited about that. So we'll have a few items out on the por on, out on my front porch that you can come and shop in person. But you can also put in requests. If there's certain things that you would like to see or that you really are interested in, let us know beforehand and we will bring them up to the porch. Um, but you, if you don't want to shop, just come visit. Just come meet us. We're all going to be there for this first one. Um, me, Lori, and Vicki. And if you are a local business and you just want to come maybe collaborate or you know, um, brainstorm how we can help each, out each other, come on by. I'll be talking more about this later. But And I'll be putting the event up soon so that you can save the date. But anyway, that's March 4th. Saturday, March 4th. So... We'll talk more about that later. But I want to make sure that I hope everybody has a great Friday the 13th. And don't let it, you know, weird you out. It's Friday. It's just a Friday. It's a Friday with a great weekend. And everyone should be happy. So have a great weekend. And I will see you next time. Bye.